Hey guys, we're here today to check out the new morph feature on the Pro 3. You can now morph between patches on the Pro 3, which opens up a whole new sound world when you're creating on this amazing instrument. Um, what you just heard was one sort of plucky patch going into another more sustained patch using the sequencer and I mapped the morph feature to the touch bar so that you can beautifully transition between those two patches. You can gradually have all the parameters of whatever patch you're on morph into the parameters of another patch. So you can achieve that effect that has rarely been seen before. It's a really interesting thing to add into your sound design palette. What's cool is that there are different modes, so not everything has to change. So for example, you could just have the frequencies change. You could have the oscillators and their shapes change. You could have all the frequencies. You could have just oscillator too. You could have the mixer, the filter. It goes on and on. There's a lot of different modes on here so that you could actually create two different patches and have them be one in the sense that it was a performance patch where you were intending to use some sort of modulation to go back and forth between the two. So the way you can set this up is you go into miscellaneous parameters and then you go to morph source and you could assign it to the touch bar or the modulation expression and a few other sources. We're going to use this simple patch I made called lead me there. We're going to pull up miscellaneous parameters and then we're going to use we're going to use the modulation amount this time to control all the parameters and we're going to use another patch I made called J3PO lead. So now when I twist this knob, we should be going back and forth between those two different lead styles. So there you go. So that could be useful when you're sewing and you want to quickly kind of get into a different territory. So I'm just going to play you some examples of uh, various patches and combinations of patches and I'm going to use the touch bar mostly to go between the two patches.
hope you enjoyed some of these patches. Um, I encourage you to download the new OS and just start messing around because it will lead to hours and hours, days, infinity of creativity. So uh, that is the new more feature for the Sequential Pro 3. All right.